Hi guys, what's up? It's me, Jenny, and welcome to your Health Matter channel. In our today's video, we will talk about hair loss for women. We will talk about symptoms, causes, and treatment of hair loss. So let's begin. We know that long, lustrous, and silky hair are trademark of many, especially females. A female's hair are her best natural accessories to carry and obviously show and even compete with her same-sex friends. But if you are amongst those 60% of the females who is suffering from with hair problems, then you know the shock of being less haired over your head. The major problem is that the hair loss in female is considered as a taboo in society and this adds to salt into bounds of the females suffering with hair loss or hair thinning problems. Women themselves do not feel comfortable in openly discussing their problems. However, men can openly discuss and thus able to try on several treatment options including treatment of hair loss, using medication, and etc. Let me tell you this, you are not the only woman who is suffering with hair loss and feeling difficulty in openly discussing and finding resolution of hair problems. And according to a clinical analysis, one in every four women is suffering with hair problems. Females also keep worrying why hair loss happens. The causes of hair loss in women can be any, like harsh hair treatments, hormonal changes during pregnancy, or the menopause. Stress and unhealthy eating habits also lead to hair problems. And sometimes, hair thinning in females may be genetic. The hair thinning as a genetic factor normally occurs between 18 to 24 years of age. And the most common form of hair loss due to genetic or other medical factors is alopecia. This is the sort of hair problem in which the hair becomes extremely thin so that one can see through it. Alopecia areta is another form of hair problem that normally start as tiny bulb patches but may result into total hair loss if not taken care of. If you can believe it, almost one quarter of the world population is suffering with some type of hair problems. And any sort of hair problems in females affect self-confidence and sometimes may even lead to anxiety and depression. The first step in setting any sort of hair problems is to distinguish the nature of hair loss you are suffering with. Of course, there are a number of treatment options available for treating hair problems depending on the kind and severity of problems. Your doctor may suggest you some oil, cream, lotion to apply on your scalps. If hair loss is due to hormonal or hereditary or due to some other serious health problems, then your doctor may prescribe you a variety of medications. And besides getting aid from a health professional, you also can take care of your hairs to avoid hair loss. How? Here are given some tips and tricks to prevent you from bad hair days. Number one should be balance your diet. Nutrition plays a vital role in keeping healthy dresses. Lack of essential vitamins and minerals and proteins, etc. may switch hair problems. Ask your doctor, nutritionist for help. And you should include vitamins B5 in your diet 
which is important factor to stop hair loss. And you should also include folic acid, biotin, and silica in your diet. You can use vitamin and mineral supplements as an alternative. And also, you must increase copper intake in your diet because it has been found that copper is helpful in maintaining hair health and stopping hair loss. Try to minimize zinc intake as it is harmful for your hair. Number 2. Opt for loose and comfortable hairstyle. You have to give up the hairstyle that introduces tensions in your hair follicles. For example, tight ponytails and plaits. Number 3. Avoid layered cuts as this creates misapprehensions of more vigor. Number 4. Do not use enlarge the heated hair styling tools such as tongs and straightening irons as this may create strain and breakage of your hair. Number 5. Use wigs and hair extensions or use hats, scarves, and funky jewelry to draw attention away from your hairs. Number 6. Ask your hairdresser to monitor your hair growth but not become obsessed about it. Number 7. Stress is a major trigger to hair loss. So, as much as possible, you have to try to stay positive. And if you have hair loss, you have to eat the following Beans Brown rice Brewer's yeast Fish Vitamin B promotes hair growth and iron is essential for hair growth. Take a spoonful of unsulfured black strap molasses every day and include several of the following foods in your diet. Berries, cashews, dried fruits, figs, green leafy vegetables, leeks, and to improve hair growth, apply 3 to 5 drops of rosemary essential oil per 1 ounce of shampoo daily to improve scalp circulation. And that's all for today guys. Please remember that while this guide is meant to provide you with the information you need to stay healthy and naturally, it is highly recommended that you consult a physician before you begin any form of regime or follow any of the suggestions in this video. Yes, I am a nurse, but I am not. I am not a doctor. If you have any side effects as a result of the following information, consult a physician immediately. Thank you again for watching. I hope that you liked the video. And if you did, please give it us a thumbs up. If you have any question, please leave a comment down below. And please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell to get updates. Have a nice day everyone. Bye. See you on my next video.